Good evening. This is Lisa Gale with the Tyra Hill Show. And we are here at the premiere of the Walk in My Shoes movie by David Lloyd Marcus. And I am here with Miss Brandy. That is her character's it's name. Easy. Not a Y or a I. Get it right. Okay. <laughs> Two E's, not an I or a Y. That's what she said. Okay. And you are? Janelle, her cousin. Okay. I-L-E. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, Brandy, tell us a little bit about your character. Um, well, I play the um, main character, which is the male character's best friend. Okay. Um, and so it's very adventurous because he has two other best friends that kind of happen throughout the movie. So it's very interesting because okay. in real life there are such things as having the more than one best, best friend. Best friend. Yes. Yes. So okay. I think it still opens up to the appeal of the movie. So okay. See the movie. Okay. Okay. Tell me your name. My name is Sean. Your name is Sean, yeah. and you are Shair. Shair. Mm -hmm. What a beautiful name. <laughs> I am Lisa Gale with the Tyra Hill Show. I, and I'd like to know why you're here at the movie premiere. What prompted you to come? This is my cousin's movie, David. Yeah. This, this is, is your cousin. cousin's Absolutely. movie. Okay, family first. Family first. <laughs> family People support. I'm very hard on this. Very okay, hard. very so hard. I'm looking forward to seeing everything. I oh. helped a little bit behind the scenes. Okay. But it's, yeah. <laughs> so you haven't seen the movie at all? No, just oh. little clips. I'm, just little clips. Yeah, I'm excited so you're like seeing it with everybody else? Yeah, everybody else. <laughs> okay, very good. Very good. That's awesome. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for stopping by. And uh, enjoy the movie. It'll be well. You too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is Lisa Gale with the Tyra Hill Show, and we are here at the Walk in My Shoes red carpet premiere. And we are with... Hi, my name is Michael D. Martin. And you play? I am actually the uh, introductory narrator in the movie. Okay, very good. You certainly have the voice for <laughs> Yes, I'll be the first voice you hear. Okay, very good. So, um, how was that experience for you? Is this the first time you're narrating? Absolutely. Okay. First, first time acting, first time narrating. It was tremendous. Okay. It was tremendous. It's awesome. I can't wait to see it, and the cast looks phenomenal, and yeah. so congratulations. Thank you so much. Alrighty, anything you want to say to the masses out there about this movie? Listen, man, you're in for a treat. Just, uh, just buckle your seatbelt, stay strapped and tight. You don't want to miss a beat. Okay, thank you so much. Winfield Taylor of Crystal Wines. Black Crystal Wine, yes. Black Crystal Wine, excuse me. And you're a sponsor of the movie? Yes. Okay, and tell us, um, what made you want to partake in this journey? Um, I know David personally. Um, he's a good friend of mine. We actually grew up together. So I already know what his capabilities are. Okay. And um, also read his books. Okay. Um, I, I know it's a, it's a great movie. I've been with him since day one since he first started with the movie okay. so i know y'all definitely in for a treat we're in for a treat in for a treat all righty and you are i am chantal manning okay and i'm here to support david as well okay he's a good friend of mine and we're just looking forward to big things all righty we thank you so much okay. and um if you could tell us where we can get your wines uh the wine is located in all liquor stores in the maryland area and soon to be in um florida and pennsylvania Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Thank you. And you all have a good evening and enjoy the movie. Thank Maybe you. Maybe coming on to the red carpet. This is Miss Tyra Hill of the Tyra Hill Show. My ace, Boom Coon, my buddy, my boss lady. And yes, she rocks and she is fierce. So, Miss Tyra Hill. Yes, darling. Tell me why you've come to support this movie, Walk in My Shoes. Well, it's always good to support our fellow brothers and sisters. Yes. And I'm excited this year because it's so many dope African American screenwriters, yes. producers, right. actors, actresses. Right. Oh yes. And so I'm excited because I'm really I want to see what the men got to say about relationships. I am excited about that too cuz you know, I can think a little one-sided sometimes mm -hmm. and right. you know, it's like, "Oh, mm, what did they say? Mm, I could have done that a little differently." Right. But it's rare that men actually open up in this kind of format to share with us their perspective on Absolutely. relationships. So I'm excited about I'm this. excited as well. And this is awesome. And can I say you look absolutely Thank gorgeous you. as always. Thank you. I'm wearing always. true diva, Veronica L. <laughs> Philly. Okay, Veronica. You know you rock, girl. Miss Tyra Hill, thank you so thank much. Thank you, Lisa. All righty. And we will see you uh, in the movie. Mm. I'm going to take a couple of shots. Okay.
your business. Tell me about how you get started and why you're here. Okay, so um, I'm a makeup artist, a local makeup artist. I have a, a makeup studio in Odenton, Maryland. Um, makeup and everything beauty is my passion, so that's the reason why I got into it. Um, I'm here tonight to just see a fabulous movie. Um, I'm, you know, supporting the locals, the local cast, local um, producer, director, and of course to get some relationships, you know, relationship <laughs> tips, especially coming from I the think that's why we're all here. Exactly. Oh, so yeah. that's the really underlying part, you know. Okay. Well, thank you, MJ. No problem. All righty. We'll see you soon. Yes. Okay. Akiba Robinson and I play Sin in the movie. Okay, what an interesting name. Yes. She plays Sin, y'all. Yes. Watch out for that. Yes. So tell me about your character. Well, I can't say too much, but but um, basically, me and my husband in the movie, we needed a lot of help. Okay. And we got, let's just say we got the help that we needed with our marriage. Okay. So that's all I have to say. All right, thank you. <laughs> and we look forward to seeing you. Okay, thank Beautiful. you. Beautiful. So Thank I'm you. loving Thank this you. dress. Thank you. Tell me your name, darling. Uh, I'm Jody, and uh, my son is the, one of the founders of uh, Wise Men Production, uh, the executive producer, Antoine okay. Chambers. Very good. Yeah. Very good. So yeah. you're excited about the premiere? Oh, I'm excited for all of it. I'm just, I'm just elated. Every time I talk about them to somebody, they see my excitement. So, That's awesome. so how was your experience playing the wife? Let me say, knowing that there was the sign. Let me just say that Sandy is um, is a very relatable character, and um, I had such an amazing, challenging time playing her because she, um, like I said, she's relatable. She's a, and and her emotional spectrum is so wide and so deep. So every single every single scene, you're going to be able to feel her. So I had a great time. You had a great time. Yes. Okay. Already. Did you learn anything personally that would enhance your relationships based on your role and your, your participation as a character in the movie? I would say that um, I didn't necessarily learn. I deepened my respect and my understanding of how to be open and remain open and learn every to be open to learn anything and everything okay. about relationships, about the world, about anything, about life. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, I thank you very much for your time. Yeah. Not going to keep you. Can I say, Queen, you look absolutely fabulous. Thank fabulous. you so much. You know? and tell me your name, ma'am. My name is Angela Marie, and I'm David Lloyd Marcus's mom, the screenwriter, director, and producer. And I understand you're also a character in the movie. Oh, very good. You've done your homework. Yes, I am. I play the mom of the leading lady. The character's name is Sandy, and it's played by Miss J.C. Moore. Okay. And how proud of you are you, are you of Dave? Oh, if there's a word, I can't even think of a word. I'm just going to say it's just a very euphoric feeling. Yeah, it just rates up there. It That's rates awesome. Up there. That's, yeah. And who is this handsome This is young David's guard brother. My godson. And this your name, Staten sir? Foster. I'm Staten Foster. He's also seen throughout um, a couple of the scenes. Okay, in the and you're in the movie as well. Yeah, okay. in, in the party scene. Doesn't he look like a party oh, guy? Oh, uh, this yeah. is the party guy. This is yeah. the party guy right here. <laughs> <laughs> he acting all shy and bashful, right? All right, y'all. This is Craig, better known as Dr. Ouch. Tell me why they call you Dr. Ouch. Um, because the truth hurts, you know what I mean? And that's what we're doing. In order to get to the root of any issue, you got to dig deep, flesh it out. And you know what I mean? Getting to the root of things, you dig up a lot of things that aren't always comfortable. And like I said, at the bottom line, truth hurts. So they call the me He's saying the truth hurts y'all. Okay. So tell me just a little bit of how you counsel the characters in this movie. Just a little. Just a little bit. Well, first, first step, first things first, we always make sure they're nice and relaxed. We make sure they have their favorite beverage of choice in order because I feel like alcohol brings out the truth in everybody. Well, I was gonna say that's very non-traditional to have alcohol during a counseling session so that's a very novel theory yeah. okay so how does that work out for the couples well ultimately it kind of cuts the edge off and and we can really get to the truth of the issues you know what I mean if we're always guarded and everybody nobody wants to expose themselves and that's what alcohol kind of do exposes the truth within you 
and loosens the lips. It loosens the lips. Okay. Anything else you want to share with the people um, about the movie, your character? Man, I mean, it was just a, a phenomenal project to be a part of. You know what I mean? I grew up with the executive producer, the director, and writer. So, you know what I mean? For us to be here doing this in our hometown, you know what I mean? It's, it's nothing but God's work. Absolutely. Nothing but God's work. Thank you very much Thank for your you. time. Absolutely. I can't wait Thank to see you, you in the movie. Hey. Absolutely. Hey. Hey. This is Lisa Gale with the Tyra Hill Show. We're at the red carpet premiere of Walk In My Shoes. And this is Mr. Antoine Chambers, yes. executive producer yes. of this phenomenal project. Mr. Chambers, yes. tell us why you became involved in this. Well, we had plenty of talks about just our future endeavors. And uh, David always been an author and writer. And then one day he came to me like, I could hear the services in his voice, and he said, man, I'm about to put a, a, a feature film together, and I need your help. Okay. And so I said, let's do it. All right. <laughs> and so, that's how so, it went. So you had that buy-in? Yeah, like, you know, it's just, um, I don't know. I, I guess he saw something in me to, to help him, and I, I believe in his work, so... It wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't really hard. Okay. Yeah. Well, obviously, it was something that you felt that you could invest in. Oh, absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Because absolutely. it's going to help the community. Well, we, we we got a mission and a goal, and that really is to build a platform that's going to help people, and um and so with this and a few other things that we plan on doing, I just I, I see it being not only a realistic goal, but like I. From, from the way things have been going, I, I think we're going to actually exceed our goals. Okay. Is there anything that you'd like to share with the general public about this project, about upcoming projects? Anything you want, any catch you want to let out the bag? Uh, it's some things I'm going to let people see for themselves, but, you know, two young men that's, that's really interested and in, invested in helping people, um, get, giving you good work. And uh, with Mr. Mark, he's just a talented individual when it comes to writing. So we got a lot of things coming in the future. Uh, things that's already done is just a matter of time of getting them finished. Okay. Well, sir, I'm not going to keep you. I know news getting ready to get started. Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate and congratulations. you. Congratulations. All right. Thank you so much. You're welcome. All right. This is Lisa Gale with the Tyra Hill Show, and we are here at the red carpet premiere of Walk In My Shoes, and this is Mr. David. Yes, ma'am. Lloyd Marcus. Yes. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Okay. This is his baby, y'all. Yes, it is. Tell us about your baby. Long time coming. Walk In My Shoes is about a, a couple that sees an unorthodox counselor that saves marriages like never before, and this film... People will be talking about this for decades. I really truly believe it's the best relationship ever because there's never been nothing that shows both sides in the way that this film does. Yes, and it's my understanding from doing a little research, but it, it definitely gives a broader perspective mm -hmm. of the men's point of view as well. Yes, that's the main thing I wanted to show because I feel like the men, sometimes we get left behind. <laughs> So you know, sure yeah. Not left behind. But but I did do it in a way I think that was very fair. Like I told, say in every interview I do that it was pretty much I interview women okay. because I wanted to make sure women's perspective was shown okay. properly as well. Yeah. Okay. Well, sir, anything else you want to say to your observing public? Want to make say come March the second, third, and fourth, and check out Walk in My Shoes. It will be here in Maryland for that weekend, and then we're gone. I don't know what city we're moving to next, but we will announce that too. Well, sir, we want to thank you. The Tyra Hill Show wishes you much success. Thank you. We know that this project's going to be phenomenal. As, as you said, yeah. we're going to change some lives for the That's better, it. right? That's it. That's what it's for, is enlightening a thought-provoking film. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -huh. uh. Famous, you shall look for me. On the Tyra Hill Show. 
Let's talk about it, Tyra Hill Show.